Everyone's heard of Botox. It's one of the most popular cosmetic procedures around for getting rid of wrinkles. Well, now a new product is on the market that's supposed to do the same thing, only cheaper. But is it better? Here's the latest on Disport. Many people come to plastic surgeon Dr. Paul Leong on the south side for the fountain of youth. Hello, Debbie. How are Hi, you? Dr. Leong. While he doesn't have that, he does have a new tool to erase wrinkles. It's called Disport. Disport has been used in Europe since uh, the early 2000s, I think 2001, and it has a long uh, record of effectiveness and safety there. Disport was approved for use in the U.S. six months ago. It works the same way as Botox. Both are neurotoxins that temporarily paralyze the muscle where they're injected. We're injecting it into the muscles that move, that cause this motion on the face. Once you relax those muscles, for a period of about four or five months, there's a very rejuvenating effect. Here's a woman with some wrinkles on her forehead and around her eyes. Here's what she looked like after Dr. Leong injected both of those areas with Disport. And here's a man with frown lines between his eyebrows and crow's feet. Here he is after Disport. Many of the wrinkles are gone. Debbie Campano of Ligonier has gotten both Botox and Disport injections from Dr. Leong. She now prefers Disport because it started working sooner. The Botox takes a little bit longer, maybe, um, I'm going to say six, seven days possibly. Um, the Disport was maybe within one to two. You know, we live in the society when everything instant, it gives us more of an instant result. Dr. Leong says it's not clear if this happens to everyone who gets Disport, but others in Dr. Leong's practice and around the country have experienced the same thing. In fact, Dr. Leong's heading up a study to learn the differences between Disport and Botox because there's no scientific research. One advantage of Disport, it costs less than Botox. Dr. Leong charges about $275 for each area where Disport is used. The same treatment with Botox would be about $50 more. Disport and Botox usually last four to five months, but after multiple uses, they can last longer. Dr. Leong sees a new use for Disport and Botox to prevent wrinkles. He says if you start treating early wrinkles regularly with Disport or Botox, new wrinkles won't form. You truly don't develop these lines in the first place. But if you start a little bit earlier in life, uh, it's, uh, we can, we can uh, pretty much remove them and then halt progress uh, on these wrinkles after that. And if you'd like more information on Disport, go to kdka.com. We have links that will get you there. And Dr. Leong says there really are some movie stars out there. They've been using Botox regularly for the past decade. And in this part of their face, they really do it stop the aging. I mean, if they're 40, they look 30. If they're 50, they look 40 in that area. Mm -hmm. So it's amazing what it could do. I suppose. <laughs>